parts of our viewing area from Birmingham, Hoover, over towards Anniston, Tuscaloosa, Talladega, you name it. We've got rain or clouds, one or the other. The only place seeing a sliver of sunshine is Tuscaloosa, and the numbers reflect it. 84 is the current temperature there, but pretty much everywhere else, we've got rain on the camera lens. Look at Hoover. Look at this cloud formation. This is because of low, uh, low forming clouds, basically. Uh, nothing scary there, even though it looks pretty ominous. This is just meaning that we have some low lying clouds right there on top of the trees. Heavy rainfall in Talladega, same with Birmingham, but I do want to point out that flash flood warning that is now in effect that expires at 8 o'clock tonight, including the city of Birmingham, Hoover, Vestavia Hills, back into Huey Town, and just north of Bull City. Over the last 24 hours, we've seen well over two inches of rain in many of these locations, and this rain is just continuing to fall. It's not really moving much. That's what generally prompts these flash flood warnings is the storms don't move. They're literally raining themselves out over these communities right now. So we are going to see heavy, heavy rainfall from Hueytown all the way through Birmingham, right along that stretch of 2059. Most of this is north of 459 until you get over towards Hoover Highway 31 up through Vestavia Hills, Montgomery Highway, taking you all the way over towards the summit as well, Altadena Road. So just keep a watchful eye out there. Very heavy rain back towards western Jefferson County into the northern part of Tuscaloosa County, where you see these deep reds and bright purples on your screen. That would sig signify the very heavy rainfall. Notice on our future scan over the next hour, yes, next hour, this little uh, cluster of showers is not moving much. We will see some lighter rain off to our east, but that heavy rain is sticking around. We're continuing to track those scattered showers through the evening and morning hours tomorrow. I'll have more on Tuesday's timeline of this wet weather. That's ahead in your storm team seven day forecast. You know,